Hallo und willkommen zurück bei Sherlock Holmes Crimes and Punishment. Wir sind in unserem zweiten Verhör. Arrow, unrasiert. Augenringe. Ich weiß gar nicht, hatte ich das schon gemacht? Ich habe nämlich zwischenzeitlich Pause gemacht. Zwei Tage dazwischen. Dreckige Kleidung. Jawohl. Moment. Ach da. Der Schweiß. So, jetzt geht's weiter. What is your occupation? I, I am a counselor at the uh, district chamber. And what were you doing at the baths? Well, I I follow the researches. I am uh, interested in, in archaeology. You follow them? Yes. So many things happened and w we need to know. Or perhaps it's better hidden. I beg your pardon, Mr. Garrow. I, uh, I, I meant nothing. But by that, I, I apologize. Hmm. What was it like to work with Sir Rodney? It was like uh, working w with a genius. He was a hard man. But then, you, you know, this world is hard. There are always people who want to steal from you. And he, uh, he, he trusted me, but, uh, oh. Are you feeling unwell? Oh, I'm sorry. He is I. Oh, I remember. Oh, I, I feel so sorry. Do you need anything? I, uh, I, I, I feel bad. I, uh, I, I hear... No, nothing. I, 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 I'm better now. His ring! Oh! It should be destroyed. Why do you say that? It is a cursed ring. Digging dark secrets. Really? I... Uh, it mm. is after me now. I know it. Uh, I shouldn't have worked on it in the workshop. It's too late now. Please try to recall what you saw today. The room was so... so hot. Uh, I had to remove my glasses. I was not feeling so very well in, in there. But you found the body. I saw the knife, you know. Flying through the air, I, I, I saw the blood. I tried to escape, I, I don't remember. You saw the knife? What did it look like? Everything was as if in a nightmare. It all happened so fast. The knife was, was shining like, like gold. Hmm. Did you place the bottle of champagne in the changing room? What? No. Auch nicht. Had Sir Rodney exhibited any recent strange behavior? Well, he, he had been rather secretive these past few days. Last Thursday, for, for example, I, I saw him leave. When he returned, it, it was very late. He showed me some wet coins, Roman coins, and uh, he started to laugh. This is the coin that, that he showed me. It is from the third century. It must be very rare. No, I, 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 I don't know. Thank you. Thank you. This will help me to calm down. Do be careful with the dosage. I, I will. I mean it. Mm. Garrow appears to be rather mentally disturbed. Either that or he is a good actor. Please escort this suspect for interrogation. Ah, ja, ja. Sollen wir uns den noch mal daran? Ne? Good day to you, Sir Gregory. My name is Sherlock Holmes. I'm assisting the police with their investigation of the murder that took place this morning. Would you mind answering a few questions? Tell me, Mr. Holmes, will I need to stay here for very much longer? Jetzt erst recht. Jetzt erst recht.
Ah, halt, stopp. You are the manager of the baths, is that correct? Yes. I'm passionate about archaeology. I wanted to restore the ruins. My ambition is to open the baths to the public. Living archaeology can be a profitable business. Although now I'm not so sure. I see. Hmm. Uh, when do you wish to begin using the baths? When the archaeological researches are over, I will be free to complete the restoration. It is the usual process. What was your relationship with Sir Rodney Bentcliffe? You were not particularly close. He had an unpleasant temperament. Suspicious, authoritarian, unkind. People possessed by genius may be forgiven for their nature, but not by me. Was he obstructive? Not at all. Everything he did led us to greater success. He helped us increase the potential of the building. Mm -hmm. How was the work progressing before Sir Rodney's arrival? Rather slowly, I would say. Uh, oh Gott. Oh Gott, zwei Tage Pause und... Uh, uh, oh Gott, uh, gekühlte Champagner, gekühlte Champagner. Sir Gregory, could you please explain this letter? You expressed the wish to call off the yeah. research work at the baths. It was all about Blinkhorn. He was merrily digging away and taking very little care about it. Ruining everything and finding nothing of any value. But the arrival of Sir Rodney changed your mind? Sir Rodney's work was extremely promising, and it was good for the bar's publicity. So yes, I changed my mind. Okay, was weißt du den Mord? Please tell me what happened this morning. The test that we performed this morning was a success. The steam was working well. But then, of course, that awful murder. What did you see? The steam was too thick to see anything. But ask Garrow. He saw the body first. Did you bring a bottle of champagne to the baths? Absolutely not. So Rodney did, I think. Mm, den können wir aber nicht fragen. Had Sir Rodney exhibited any recent strange behavior? Look, I'm not a suspicious fellow. But I think that he had professional interests elsewhere that he did not wish us to know about. Why should you think that? Where? I have no idea. But after all, it was not my business. Ja, aber es war doch dein... Es ist doch deine Therme. Are you aware that Mr. Garrow is under a form of medication? Garrow? No. But I never liked that parasite. Do you believe him to be capable of murder? Well, he did have blood on him. Does that make him a murderer? Äh, uh, nicht zwangsläufig. Nicht zwangsläufig. Mm. <lacht> Der Rodneys Lüge. Der Rodney hat im Hinblick auf seine Ziele alle belogen. Er arbeitete heimlich auf eigene Faust. Garrows Medikament. Garrow nimmt starke Medikamente zur Behandlung von Melancholien. Brille. Garrows Brille liegt auf dem Kohlenbeck in den Term. Aufgrund der Hitze ist ein Brillenglas gesprungen. Okay. Eine Notiz. Ja. Yeah. Tödliches Geheimnis. Warum hätte Sir Rodney etwas verbergen wollen? Könnte seine Entdeckung das Motiv für den Mord an ihm sein? Jetzt schon. <lacht> Die letzte Expedition. Finden Sie heraus, wohin Sir Rodney einige Tage vor seinem Tod gegangen ist und lüften Sie sein großes Geheimnis. Wir noch mehr Hinweise, die wir kombinieren können. Sir Gregory wollte Blinkhorn entlassen, um die Ausgrabung in den römischen Thermen zu stoppen. Auf diese Weise hoffte er, die Thermen der Öffentlichkeit zugänglich zu machen. Rechtzeitig sagte er, rettet die Asche. Blinkhorns Demütigung. Blinkhorn arbeitet durch das Eingreifen von Sir 
Rodney gerettet doch das Gegensätze Kosten seiner Moral. Blinkhorns Interesse. Blinkhorn arbeitet, wurde durch das Einkaufen gerettet. Er war sehr dankbar für das Gesetz. Könnte sein. Sonst. Ja. Also wir haben glaube ich noch. <lacht> ich muss klicken. Ähm, wir haben noch. Genau, die Zange und äh, fahren zu den Thermen, holen das Metall daraus. Das haben wir nämlich noch nicht gemacht, bevor wir da weggefahren sind das letzte Mal. Ne? Finden Sie die verschwundene Tatwaffe mit der Rodney von Clifford Mortimer? Jawohl. Oh nein, ich habe die Leiche nicht untersucht. Oh nein, jetzt sind wir da wieder weggefahren. Ich habe die Leiche nicht untersucht. I should analyze this melted metal. Genau. Hallo, lass mich. Lauf doch mal. Hä? Also die Steuerung ist schon sehr, sehr hakelig. Bleibt immer irgendwo hängen. Muss ich mit dem dann nochmal reden? Okay. Äh, wo ist das Fritschi da? Hier rum zu rennen. Immer noch. Watson kommt mit. Watson kommt mit. Dann analysieren wir mal das Metall schnell. Fahren zu Scotland Yard. Untersuchen den Eichnamen. This is a piece of metal taken from a brazier. It appears to be silver, but I need to be sure. If it is silver, it will be possible to melt it, since silver's melting point is at around 900 degrees Celsius. Let us compare this sample with a silver penny by testing it with acid. If it changes color to match the result of a reaction with a silver coin, then it is silver. Hmm. Wollte man das andere benutzen? The reaction is the same red stain. It is silver. Britannia silver quality. wurde Britannia Silber gefunden, sehr flüssiges Blut. Ne, es gibt mir jetzt so nix. Ne. Hat alles nichts miteinander zu tun. Dann hätten wir das jetzt ab zu Scotland Yard. Die Leiche untersuchen, das habe ich eben vergessen. Oh Mann, ey. <lacht> Gehen wir halt nochmal zurück in die Thermen. Ach, in die nach Scotland, ja. Und untersuchen die Leiche. Ja, mal ein bisschen. Ob hängen bleibt.
According to the coroner, there were no cardiac problems nor lung congestion, but there were traces of fungus, possibly contracted from the Egyptian tombs. An unusual wound, inflicted by a curved knife, which resulted in instant death, as the coroner's report says. The coroner observed no stomach nor liver disease, if we're to accept that Sir Rodney was an occasional drinker and 63 years of age. Okay, but also was he actually gesund? He was, was gesund. Ah. Oh. The bruising is in lines. Some light bruising caused by a rope. They were caused by a rope around the waist. Sir Rodney was descending somewhere. Hmm. Okay. Oh nein, jetzt muss ich wieder in die Baker Street. Oh nein. Ich habe die Karte nicht analysiert. Ah oh Gott, man merkt echt, dass man mich wirklich wach bringt. Oh mein Gott, ey. Das gibt's doch nicht. Vergesse ich das? Ich vergesse ich das. Das darf doch nicht wahr sein. My archive. I can always consult with it if needed. Ah. Ach nein, hier. Karte. Ah, Karte. Two maps. Oh. Watson, pack your bag. We are visiting a location in St. Albans marked on Sir Rodney's map. Ta-da! Okay. This archaeological site has been abandoned. Why did Bentcliffe come here? This archaeological site has been abandoned. Why did Bentcliffe come here? Danke. Muss ich irgendwie reinkommen. So. Und jetzt joggen wir mal hier über die. Ich untersuche. This is the map of the site. We are at the heart of an old Roman city. Na, glaube ich, lesen wir ihn das nächste Mal oder gleich. Ich nehme hier alles. Das ist echt der voll die Kleptomane. Kann doch nicht wahr sein, du. Guck dich das doch an, das steckt alles ein. Von irgendwo hin. The door has been left open. Someone did not care or was in haste. Das ist nie. Dokumente kann ich nicht nehmen, nein, darf ich nicht. Nein, darf ich nicht.
the Cyclops, a one-eyed creature helping Vulcan at the forge. Vulcan, the god of fire and metalworking. <laughs> Construction hooks. Gut, so weit, so gut. Dann sehen wir uns in der nächsten Folge bei Sherlock Holmes and Punishments. Ich hoffe, ich kann das diesmal richtig lösen. Und so, damit verabschiede ich mich. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen. Schön, dass ihr wart. Bleibt gesund, bleibt zu Hause, wenn ihr könnt. Und dann bis zur nächsten Folge. Tschüss.